Hey, yo, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Bask here. Back at the game with another last shot video. Mmm. And that ramen game is getting to me. But yeah, guys, today we're going to be watching a Overwatch 2 trailer, which is a pretty much a new hero gameplay trailer, you know. Wah, 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 wah. Sorry. <laughs> I get a little bit quirky at times. But yeah, this is supposed to be like a close to a two minute trailer of Venture. I hope I'm saying that right. And, um, yeah, obviously a lot of you guys are going to be like, well, really, you can watch a trailer about Overwatch 2 when we know that game is not really doing good right now. But, honestly, Overwatch 2 is not a completely terrible game. Even though there's a lot of bad things surrounding it, it, it do need a lot of tweaks before it can become worthy. And for the love of God, please bring PvE to satisfy us, okay? Because one thing I will say about Overwatch 2 is that Overwatch 2 is pretty much just a, uh, it's just it's just a redesign. No, not redesign. I should say, uh, a graphic upgrade. Y'all literally, they spent years on talking about they're gonna do some big Overwatch 2, but yeah, we we all know the whole topic about Overwatch 2. It's not really and it's not a game that's going to earn game of the year. This game is going to sadly this game is going to eventually die down as one of the worst games in history. Even though I'm pretty sure there are worse games. Damn, well that's car. But uh of course with all that being said though, I'm not just I'm not going to shit talk Overwatch 2 because that can be left for somebody who actually plays a game consistently still even though the game is not really the same. Well, as it actually it is the same, just barely improved. But of course, with all being said, though, let's hop straight into this new character venture, new hero gameplay. Begin the excavation log. Sloan Cameron here on side to Petra. By the way, guys, I have to restart this because the quality was so trash. And not only that, um. Also, I knew she was going to come out because, fun fact, Blizzard, if you're watching this, if you watch this, no offense, I know I said a lot of bad things about the game already, and obviously you can improve it, so obviously I'm not saying it's your guys' fault, but y'all really need to step up y'all game if y'all want this game to like literally pop off right now, because y'all still, y'all got, y'all got potential, y'all can still, y'all still got an opportunity to pop off, not as much as when it launched, but you still got opportunity. But besides that point, the point that I'm truly want to make out here is that I knew that she was going to come out because, fun fact, there are leakers. There are people who leaked this character a long time ago, way before she was ever announced. So, um, yeah, Blizzard, you might want to step on that because people are just leaking your character left and right to the point where I'm not even surprised that she's out. I'm just like, okay, she's fine. Okay, they finally released a trailer for her showing that she's the, that she's the next one to come out. So, yeah, just hopefully y'all can do something about them leakers because leakers are running rampant. You feel me? Me and the White Finders just found the coolest artifact I think I've ever... Again? Come on! Whoa, whoa, whoa. If you want to mess That's with better. these artifacts, you got to go through me. Okay, so that's even like that's her primary fire. I wanna do can't can't with the drill dash, can you actually charge towards somebody and actually stun them or do damage? I wonder I wonder what happens if you go in direct contact with somebody when you do that. Okay, yeah. That's the thing that, that was interesting. Is that I wonder, can I use like Ooh, one thing I'm interested in is can can I use like the drill dash to actually like keep myself from being booped out of um out of certain areas where it's like can like can I like do a mid air mid air dash? You feel me? 
I want to know with Venture can I do a mid air dash because one thing I one thing I will say this particular map and uh, there's another one I forgot the name of the maps I don't really pay attention to the map names I mostly just pay attention to the characters and Alora of course but one thing I will say is that I wish that when you get booped as her you can actually like dash right back onto the platform because one thing I will say it's like this is a good thing they show this where obviously the Reinhardt he really can't really do much when she's burrowing like this and not only that she can get she can get close and personal but at the same time it's like it wouldn't really matter because his alt lasts long enough so this is cool with the right setup this is good this is a good ability to use against him but the chance of you actually getting an opportunity to do this is almost one to none i should say I believe that's what I want to say about this, but whatever. But yeah, so far, Barrel seems like it's a really good ability. Even though, I don't know. Wait, matter of fact, I think, I wonder what happened if you Reinhardt shatter, shatter her when she does this. Does it actually affect her? It should. I'm pretty sure it should. It should still affect her. Maybe, I don't know. But yeah, so far, this is, this is looking fun. It looks fun. But the question is how it does in game. Okay. Okay, that's what I didn't pay attention to. Just like how how Venture how this how this trailer of Venture hitting uh Baptiste and he died to it. I'm starting to think that maybe if you charge directly at somebody, that's like a decent low health, you can finish them off with that with that uh, ability, which is like such a dick move, cause like, it's like the ultimate attempt, like I'm not gonna shoot you, I'm just gonna use, waste one of my abilities and just shit on you up, and cl up close and personal. <laughs> yep, that's also another thing that people gonna like, is the fact that when you barrel, she can't hurt you. Cause let's be honest, I am one of those people who hate Farah. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm sorry if I mess up her name, okay? I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. But I fucking hate this character. I fucking hate Farah. Because, and the thing is, it's like, she's not super annoying if her aim is good. But there are times where I just want to relax. I don't want to sweat so much. And her ability gets annoying because how you can get, you be getting bounced around. And like, I'm sorry, it just, I don't really like Farah. <laughs> I don't really like Far. She's not super annoying, but there are days where I just, I just don't like dealing with this. And the reason why I say that is because most Faros, they they always hide and play like a bitch. I'm sorry, excuse me for my language, but Faro players, they always be hiding behind pillars, buildings, or whatever they can hide behind. And they'll like, and they'll like doing the pop shots and shit. They are the definition of fucking flankers. Strong definition of fucking flankers with rockets, by the way. Time to really drill it in. Yep. I just can't believe my eyes. We did it. Which is interesting because yet again her ult is just a Reinhardt. It's literally just Reinhardt ult. But with a wider uh, range, I think. Well not a wider range, but it goes further. I think hers like Reinhardt. Her ultimate is like Reinhardt's ultimate, but it goes further. And it's rather than it being like an aerial aerial effect, it like it's like a cone. You feel me? It's like a cone. I feel like that's where thing is. Just based off of what they display here. We had a party or what? And by the way, I do not mean to shit on Faro players, because obviously I'm not saying that y'all completely terrible. I'm just saying that there are times where I get very annoyed when trying to kill the Faros because of how a lot of time healers be pumping so many heals into them that it makes it very hard to kill them at times. I'm sorry. It, I got I got a little bit of a vendetta against Faro players. That's that's just me. But hey, at the end of the day, you know, most most of the times I just look at myself and I just think, hey. That's just a skill issue, my brother. That's a skill issue. And you have the right to say that's a skill issue. You have the right to say that. 
look, I have my worst and I have my best. You gotta cut me, a, you gotta, well, cut me some slack. That's what I should say. I'm pretty sure what that was saying is like new map thing. That's a whole new map thing. Yep, Overwatch 2 Season 10 begins on April 16th, which is next month. Yep, next month in about a few weeks. Hmm. <sighs> it's strange. Can I look at her character? I cannot tell what type of character she is. Like... What what's her background? I can't really tell, you know. At this point we got so many um so many people looking like one thing and then just to find out that they're mixed or something. But of course that doesn't matter. Either way, so far my first impressions of her so far. So far she doesn't seem like she's gonna be that annoying of a character. I mean, yeah, she's probably gonna be quite annoying for some people people but who knows it all depends on how she gets released but so far her barrel ability seems very useful for getting her out of tight spaces her drill dash is also good for getting her out of tight spaces not only that it can she can use that ability to actually finish off some kills with people who are literally low health that's if they don't have the easy escape ability escape ability and well her projectile doesn't her projectile doesn't seem that hard to deal with. As long as she don't do a lot of damage, her projectiles are not that annoying. So far, from my depiction, she's not a tank. She's definitely not a support. She's definitely a DPS, guaranteed. Just like the leakers have said, she's a DPS, and yep, that's clearly shows here that she is a DPS. There is no way in hell that she is a fucking tank. And I mean, she can be a tank, because let's be honest, there are, there's Zarya, who, no, Zarya actually looks like a tank when you actually think about it. She like the typical, I'm not going to say that. Um, <laughs> but yeah, so far, based on my first impression, impression, she don't seem like that crazy of a character, but she definitely, she definitely going to shake up some things if, that's if, they release her right. I'm pretty sure they're gonna release her to the point where she's actually a little bit broken. Cause so far I can't really think of any character she do well with actually. I mean you probably will say Reinhardt, but no. That's don't don't go there. Don't go there. Don't go there. Matter of fact, no, that's actually my mindset. Why the fuck am I thinking of Reinhardt? Oh never mind, it's because of the the ults are looking just the same. Uh it like it like they recycle Reinhardt's ultimate and gave it to her that's what it looks like a dps reinhardt type of shit but wait range and whatever either way one thing i gotta say is is that if you got any <sighs> relax will relax that bubble tea you got you feeling different you gotta relax if y'all got anything y'all want to tell me let me know if you if there's anything you know about her that i don't know let me know if there's anything you want to want me to re like just watch in general about the upcoming season of Overwatch 2 or anything else, make sure you go down in the comment section. You can do anything. You can request a video. You can talk about the video we watched today. Anything. It's completely up to you. You you make the choices around here, people. I mean, I'll watch whatever because obviously I watch videos all the time, man. I don't do anything better with my time. But um, yeah, with all that being said, too... My next video, I don't know what's going to be, but I'm thinking that I'm going to upload another video of Kareem Ryder. Sorry if I butchered it. I'm, I'm American, okay? I didn't go out of my way to actually understand how to say it. Uh, even though I watched a, watched a playlist on it with my dumb ass. Um, and yeah, make sure you subscribe if you want to see more videos like this on the channel. And, um... Yeah, that will be all for today, okay? I love you guys, okay? Stay love, stay truthful, and always keep your prayers up. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next video, okay? Deuces.